Hello, what is up everybody? RL for 50 Sun here, back with yet another diecast car video. Today we're gonna review the Porsche 911 Carrera RS 2.7 from the FNG case. And uh, this is number 8 out of 10 from Red Racers, number 125 out of 250. And this is from the 75 years of Porsche. Let's go ahead and open this up. This is another new casting produced by Hot Wheels, basically by Mattel. One of the new castings. We've seen a bunch of 911s since like, uh, I don't know, 1980s, 1990s of Hot Wheels. They've been uh, highly produced for Mattel, basically. They are, there are a lot of versions of 911s. We had the 911 Turbo, we had the 911 uh, Carrera, we had the uh, previous generation of 911s, basically we had the newer version also, the GT3, the GT3 RS, uh, I, yeah, GT3, and a bunch of more cars from 911s. But this is uh, the mid-generation of the 911s, basically we call it. It's not very classic-y, but still powerful. 911 here we have the uh, like middle of the generation of 911s basically which is uh, still people like it till today a lot of them love this casting basically this specified version of the 911s e 2.7 which is uh, very popular throughout the whole world especially for Porsche fans basically they like this uh, 2.7 a lot so basically Mattel decided to release it as the first time in the F case, which a lot of people like it uh, very much. And basically, obviously, white is the first color, so many people will want it. Obviously, it's so hard to find in stores. Basically, this particular version, this particular color, very hard to find. And uh, yeah, basically, the other color is also very hard to find. If you're wondering, What's the other color? It's basically in metallic orange, which is, which was leaked quite a while ago. So um, yeah, it has released in some places uh, in the world, but uh, it's hard for me f to find the orange one. Basically, it's uh, quite hard because obviously many people like this casting. They want the orange one as well. I don't know why, but still, uh, well. At least I have the white one for now. Not sure where to find the orange one, but still. Uh, I'm just gonna go move along with the white one for now. So basically, it's in metallic white, and as you can see, there are some stripes at the side of the car, basically in blue. And also some extra details at the back, which I'm gonna show you in detail right now. So yeah, let's go ahead and check it out. Here's the 911. Uh, RS 2.7 here So basically base color is in metallic white. It's more of like the base color So in real life, there are a bunch of uh, Different colors for this casting mainly white and blue Other colors would be white and red white and green uh, What else? There's like orange and black yellow on you yellow and black black and red uh, green and white was it I'm not sure uh, there were like other specific colors which I can't recall much maybe blue and white as well but yeah this is the white and blue version basically so what it means is it's white for the full car and it has some blue extra bits on the car itself, for example, this side stripe right here, which is in not too dark blue, obviously, but uh, it has Carrera written on the side as well on the blue stripe that it says right there. It says Carrera throughout the side, which uh, is also on the door, obviously. So yeah, that's on the side, fully, uh, fully metallic white on the side, very clean, very nice just has that blue stripe which adds a bit of touch to it 
and uh, yeah they use these type of rims I don't remember what it's specifically called but still they have some silver lining on it obviously which is very cool nice touch to the car moving on to the front you have some grayish headlights right there you have the Porsche logo on the hood very long hood as you can see obviously a classic Porsche you already know it you have a, a, some room for the license plate which is not available on the Hot Wheels version obviously so the bottom part like for the front bumper is plastic and the rear bumper is basically plastic but the whole top part of the car is metal as you can see so this part is basically plastic but still it's in a different type of tone of white because it's plastic it's a bit different but it's fine as long as they don't paint it maybe like black it would be quite weird because uh, it doesn't match the car very well black interior as you can see uh, windows are tinted uh, not really tinted but still quite cool uh, obviously the roof is empty nothing on the spoiler as well uh, here's the other side if you're wondering moving on to the back uh, it has some more blue bits at the back as well so this Porsche at the back some uh, some blue stripe at the back and it has some detail at the back part of the spoiler as well I mean the lip of the spoiler of course it says 75 which is 75 years and also it says Carrera which is quite cool I do quite like it now they did the rear lights but not as detailed as you might have expect instead they use the part of the um, the windshield and the side windows and used it for the rear lights which is quite lazy I know Mattel when it comes to doing rear lights or headlights they like to just uh, think of ideas and just save cost and put it on the rear lights obviously you know Mattel so um, yeah the bottom part of the car I mean the rear bumper is also in plastic even the exhaust pipe right here one exhaust pipe is also plastic no rear license plate as you can already tell moving on to the base base is in white as well plastic as you can see Porsche 911 Carrera RS 2.7 Made in Malaysia 2022 Mattel mm, and uh, yeah that basically that's all I know many people that will get their hands on this car basically are either a fan of Porsche or they collect a lot of Porsches or either they have this car in real life which is uh, not many people own this car in real life even though they come in a lot of colors some of them are exclusive like they're only like uh, maybe four to five of each color produced which is quite hard to find like for example try to replicate it from a Lamborghini Sian if you've already known the Sian has like only few units which are available and each of the units are in different colors which there are only few of them produced so something similar to this because this is a car from the 90s and 80s basically quite an old car so they have limited production pro productions of the car itself obviously the color applies to it as well but yeah that was the Porsche 911 Carrera RS 2.7 I'm gonna put it next to the Audi Sport Quattro but yeah there you go let me know what you think of the Carrera RS 2.7 are you gonna pick it up or maybe not let me know down in the comments once again thank you guys for watching see you in my other videos don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one see you soon bye bye